Hello and welcome to the first edition of our weekly news update, or as we like to call it, a meal on football. It'll be a weekly news roundup of all events that'll be happening around the area. We hope that with your support we will be able to bring this section in more detail and more often in the future. Last Thursday week during the Kerry Film Festival saw the premiere of the film Men of Ventry by local director Brendan Hulwan. The film is part of a series of programmes that Brenda has made with the company Divinia Trinita, who also made Bibina and Bibina America. I'm going to talk to Brendan Hulwan and I'm going to talk to you about the film. I'm going to talk to you about the film. Do you want to talk to you about the film? Do you want to talk to you about the film? Yes, I want to talk to you about the film. I'm going to talk to you about the film. I'm going to talk to you I was just going to write a raw. I was 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 going that's very cute, isn't it? Very low-fi. Yeah. And how much fun can you finish? Let me kill you. I will just go on for a. Do you get me to consent? Yes, I will consent. I will do the new lesson here. I will do the new lesson here. Yeah. What's that? 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 I guess we'll know no bird perish to shock on the river. Oh, Tom, we'll know nobody has to get bring down the river. I guess we'll get me near to the end of the turn. Oh, Tom, yeah. Oh, I mean, the end of the day, you're going to get the river. I guess, and will you have a good force? Yeah, yeah. Oh, she's getting me. I can't even force a bring it. Oh, it's very shame, ma. Sorry if you had this, you're going to be let go. I'll have a good meal, ma. Good luck. Men of Ventry documents the lives of the life experiences of the real men from Ventry. Now, the Phoenix is packed out the door on the night, with everyone really looking forward to the subject of the film. And not one person left disappointed. The film is full of roguery, life lessons, Gaelic, football and personal stories. And the audience were in stitches of laughter at some of the anecdotes. I guess um no the finim chair of jaws, that we show og I guess I should have a force and by the way. I guess the story could be shown or have a force. Um the the part in the fuel the mail in Bjorch, I guess my old name is here. I guess my old Kajum or Kepsh I guess hard weather told me in the bad. Well, Gurmila Malcolm Murch, how soon you come good a great night was had by all and with a wonderful atmosphere and something akin to the Oscars. The programme will be shown again on TG Gaha during the Christmas period. Now unfortunately, before his time, Michael Francy, a character that was the essence of the Phoenix cinema, passed away this week. We give our heartfelt sympathies to his family and as they say, his like will never be seen again. Now, lots of people say that this area is dead this time of year and going into the new year. However, there are plenty of events happening all over, including a poetry festival run between Ballyferreter and Dingle. Poets will be coming together this Sunday in Ballyferreter reciting their poems in the Ballyferreter Museum and in the D-shirt here in town. Now, for more information available about the festival, ring Maureen Ferreter on 087-130-9800. One very active place in Dingle is Labna Monastrock, that's run by Anya Nicoli. There are plenty of events coming up, including a concert this weekend, which we will let Anya tell you more about. 
You're all very welcome here, Fáilte Mórróiv, into On Lab, which is the Irish language theatre in Dingle, up in the monastery, up uh, on John Street. Uh, now, I have a few things I want to tell you about that are going on here. We're very busy these days, actually, and I'm grateful to Scruggle for this opportunity to let you know what's happening. First of all, we have a great concert coming up next Saturday night, the 12th, with Raw Bar Collective, which is a group of musicians. Uh, among them, we have Conal O'Groda on the flute, uh, Benny McCarthy on the box, uh, Dave Sheridan on the fiddle, um, Colin Murphy on the barone, and that wonderful young traditional singer from Coulee, Nell Necronin. So don't miss it. It's going to be a lovely concert and a great way to warm up a cold um, dark November night. Uh, the tickets are at the door and they're also in Lacaray shop, um, which I'm grateful for, and they, uh, they'll cost you a mere 15 euros or 12 euros, uh, depending. So be sure and be there. Now, that looks like it'll be a fun night. Barney has more information about the concert and up and coming events that will be held there. The Camp Hill community was set up in Dunsheen in 2004 and they're doing Trojan work with people with special needs. They do gardening, weaving and lots of other activities and in the near future are hoping to build a new building for the residents to live in. However, there is always lack of funds with voluntary groups so because of that they're holding a concert night. The concert will include over 100 of Camp Hill members and the Blasket Centre Island which starts at 8pm. They have been busy practising in Dunquin all week hoping to draw a large crowd and it'll be a great night. We highly recommend for all to attend and to see the great work that Camp Hill are doing. Now, they say that the wheel never stops turning and that's true when it comes to businesses in Dingle. They come and they go and they change. One shop that moved to Ballinaboola during the economic boom is Fitzgerald's Hardware. This week, however, they're moving part of their shop back into Dingle Town behind the Centre Supermarket on Main Street and they are leaving the building materials back in Balnaboola and moving everything else into Dingle. A lot of people thought it was a lot handier to have everything under the one roof in town. And as we said, the wheels keep on turning. And they will be reopening the two shops next Monday. Well, that's it for our first of the weekly news roundup of Email and Fubble. And don't forget that to keep developing this segment, we need your help in sending news stories or events our way. From me, Aidan O'Shea and Scruggle TV, We'll see you next week.